these subjective feelings. Rather, it's grounded in what the Word of God and who is Jesus Christ or the the Word of Yehovah and who is Yeshua the Messiah. Under the Messiah, some Christians rely too heavily on their experiences and feelings instead of relying on the scripture and what God says. It's certainly unfortunate, but in some times that everyone can be cautious, it's something that everyone can be cautious of from now on as we get through this little lesson tonight. We want to be cautious of this from now on. Suffice it to say what? Though there are times in our lives where it's good to uh, to be encouraged by the Bible and sometimes the best place to go are passages that speak about being what? Close to God. Close to God. I'm going to go over through passages tonight and I want you to get it in your, in, in your, in your mind and in your spirit. You know, I'm going to be talking very briefly about God's placing you in him. Now, now, what are you talking about, Zari? I said God is placing you in him. Now, we went through a uh, revelation, and I thought that was very profound, that I'm, I'm in a space called God, having a God experience, and God is exposing himself to me. Thank you for your word, God. In Hebrews 4 and 8, in Hebrews 4 and 8, draw near to God and he will draw near to you. Cleanse your hands, you sinners, and purify your hearts, you double-minded. This verse makes a bold statement. If we draw near to God, he will what? He will draw near to us. God isn't going to do everything for you, just like in a strong romantic relationship. Both parties must be willing to join together in fellowship, spend quality time with one another, and be willing to what? To communicate. You got to speak to each other. The same holds true in the relationship between God and man. He is always willing and able, but we must what? Do our part and stop draw and, to, and start drawing nearer. You know, it's nothing like being in a relationship, uh-huh, and there's no friendship or fellowship. You understand what I'm saying? It's like the event is your anniversary. You know, you got the um, you got the candles and the ambiance. You got she's got on a gown and and you got on your tux or your nice suit and and you're in a five star restaurant and the, the violinist is playing. Uh huh. And 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 the the ambiance is all there. Oh Shabbat. But you don't like her and she don't like you. I'm the There's no there's no there's no love there. I'm the There's no fellowship. Mm hmm. There's there's nothing there. You know you can't draw because you're not coming together as one. You understand what I'm saying? And so this is the way it is with Yehovah. And in some cases, there are people under the Diosaya. You know, your children uh, will abandon you. I, I, you know, I had a friend of mine, uh, older friend, uh, Dorinda. Dorinda's in her 90s. I should have said not a friend of mine. She is. She's a. She still is a friend of mine. She's still living. And she told me. She said. She said. Listen. She said. You got to have. You got to make this amount of money. Whatever the denomination is, eight figures, whatever it is. She said. And you got to be careful how you spend it. She said because your children will not take care of you. And then it Osiah. She told me a long time ago. She said you got to be able to. It'll come a time in your life where somebody's going to have to live with you, son. You so you got to be prepared for that. And then it Osiah. See, the very people that you think would never leave you will leave you alone. I, I could say some other things that, that I experienced even with my father, but I'm not going to go into that because God is talking of something different tonight. He's talking about I'm drawing you or I'm placing you in me and I've chosen you. See, the reason why a lot of you can't go nowhere because 
guess what? God is not finished with you. There's another, there's another raising of the hands and saying, yes, Lord. There's another clap that you got to do. There's another hallelujah. There's another thank you, Jesus. You got to open up the door for somebody. There's another, there's another smile that you got to put on your face to somebody. I don't care if you're limping, rolling. I don't care what your condition is. God can still use you. Right where you are, man, woman, boy, and girl. Uh, in Psalm 65 and 4, blessed is the man who chose who chooses and causes to approach you, Oshabo, that he may dwell in your courts. And we shall be, what, satisfied with the goodness of your house, of your holy temple, Undeosaya. Well, you know, those who are close to the Lord will definitely, what, be satisfied. And ultimately, Yeshua, Jesus brings all that are his are his ultimate sanctification. Everybody that belongs to Yehovah or Yeshua comes to the ultimate sanctification. Everything is met. Everything is needed. There's no way that you can get Yeshua the Messiah or Jesus in you and be incomplete. You understand what I'm saying? Listen, let me tell you, and you can't be defeated with him. Ah, Yehovah, and that's what God is doing. I don't care where you are. You can be 80 to 13 under the video site. If you get Yeshua in you, you'll find that yourself will be ultimately complete. You won't have the desires and the taste under the Diosaya of those of the world under the Diosaya because with Jesus, when he comes in you and you come at him, uh huh, I'm in the world but not of the world under the Diosaya. So the worldly desires and tendencies, uh huh, they pass right by. Glory to God. Some of that stuff has been locked away. You understand what I'm saying? And destroyed. Oh, bless his holy name under the Diosaya. Because I've learned one thing, when you begin to love on Yeshua, you begin to love on Jesus. The more I love him, I'm the Diosaya. And the more he loves on me, the more I got to love him, Oshaba. The more he does, see Oshaba. You know, I, I would want to go one place. And you know, because the love of Jesus and has been such a on such an intense day loving him and talking and speaking with him, I got to go to another place. Why? Because I don't want to do anything to please or displease Yeshua or Jesus or God. You understand what I'm saying? When you're married under the video side, there are certain places, brothers, that you're not going to go, O Shabbat, because your wife wouldn't find that to be a good area, O Shabbat. It may uh, cause your children to come to wrath under the video side. Uh -huh. So you, you, you your, your life is predicated and your decision making is predicated on how under the Diosaya it would affect that little son you got, that daughter, Oshaba, uh -huh, that mother, that father, under the Diosaya. Oh, bless his name. I don't want to do anything to disappoint my dad, my daddy, Oshaba, or my mom, under the Diosaya, or my mom. You understand what I'm saying? There ain't no need in saying father and mother right now, under the Diosaya, because I'm talking about Oshaba. About. God has called you under the Diosaya, and then he's placing you in him, Ashabo, and he has chosen you. In the book of Psalms 145 and 18, the Lord is near to all who call upon him, to all who call upon him in truth, Oshaba. And that's the key thing. You got to call God in truth, Oshaba. This is certainly a wonderful promise. What? That Jesus will be near to any one who calls on him, but you must call him in truth under the video side. You got to be upright. You got to be right standing. You got to be doing the things of God. There's nothing like the presence of almighty God. There's nothing like being in the space of God. A uh, man should always pray and not faint under the video side. It's not just on Sunday that you show up with your collar under the video side, buster. Oh, no, 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 no. But guess what? You got 
to have your collar on under the deal, sire, or your garment, on on Monday under the deal, sire. Monday may be a day that you got the garment of praise because you got the spirit of heaviness under the deal, sire, and under the deal, sire, something about the garment of praise. You got to wear it Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday under the deal, sire. You got to wear the intercession Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday under the deal, sire. I got to have, oh Shabbat, it's just like my shoes, oh Shabbat. I dare not go out of my house with the sword of the spirit under the deal, sire. My feet shod in the gospel of peace. Oh, bless on his name. The helmet, oh Shabbat, of salvation under the deal, sire. The shield of faith, huh? To, to, to stop all those fiery darts of the devil under the deal, sire. You got to dress like this. Why? Because I'm in God's presence, O Shabbat. I'm in God under the deal. God has placed me in this space, O Shabbat. And because God is surrounding me and he's beginning to minister me and he's taking over my, my, my very being, his creation. Why? Because he created me for a purpose. Amen. And the more and more I release under the video sign, just give up the will. As I often say, take my will forever. I will doubt thee never. Ushaba. Cleanse my soul, dear master. Ushaba. Make me holy in thine. In 2 Timothy 2 and 13, if we are faithless. Uh, he remains faithful. He cannot what deny himself, O Shabbat, even in times when we are completely unfaithful to God. He does not change under the Deosiah. He will always remain what faithful because it is part of of who he is, Ashabu. That's right. You ever seen it where somebody is, somebody's nasty and you still be kind, or they're nasty and you still be sweet? They come with a lie and you got to tell the truth, Ushaba. Why? Because that's just who you are under the Didi Osaya. There's nothing like God. Even when you turn your back on him, oh Shabbat, he's yet still there. I'm the video side. He'll still receive you if you repent. I'm the video side. If you turn back to him, I'm the video side. This passage allows us to understand that it's time for you, oh Shabbat, that may be listening to me and you're, you're kind of lukewarm, oh Shabbat, that you make a U turn and walk back, I'm the video side, to your first love, I'm the video side, that you begin to walk back to God, oh Shabbat, uh -huh. the past is the past, but guess what, you can turn around, oh Shabbat, and walk back to God, and guess what, he ain't going to change it, he'll yet still remain faithful, under the Deosiah, God wants to do it for you, under the Deosiah, see, because the people of God hear God, under the Deosiah, they know God, oh Shabbat, and I know there's some of you under the sound of my voice tonight, under the Deosiah, that is yet hearing God, oh Shabbat, uh, you may have the question, are you talking to me, O Shabbat? Uh-huh, but Nidhi Osiah. And then there's some, I know, O Shabbat, that God is speaking to me, O Shabbat. You were standing, or you may have been sitting, O Shabbat, and you found yourself on your knees under the Nidhi Osiah, right while I'm speaking, or you, you got them, you make another position move, O Shabbat. It may be your leg going up, it may be your hand going up, your head may go down under the Nidhi Osiah. It may even cause tears to run from your face. Why? Because God is calling me, O Shabbat. I heard him say it under the Didi Osiah, and God is calling me under the Didi Osiah back to him or in him, and I'm chosen under the Didi Osiah. What a declaration in John 10 and 27, O Shabbat, and verse 28. My sheep hear what? Hear my voice, and I know them under the Didi Osiah, and they follow me. And I give them eternal life, and they shall never what perish, neither shall anyone snatch them out of my hand. Ushaba. This is the protection under the Didi Osaya. This is this is the guarantee, Ushaba. This is the word of God. This what makes us be drawn closer to God. This is what the forces us into what the presence of him, to being in him, being 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 joined with him. You know how in most cases they don't do it as much as they used to back in the old days when I was coming up. But you know, when a man marries a woman, she takes on his name. It ain't it wonderful? That when I come together with God, I'm 
joined together. We're not separated. Uh huh. I'm not Smith. I'm the Didi Osiah, and he's Jones. Oh Shaba. No, I'm joint heirs. Oh Shaba. I am a son of God. I'm the Didi Osiah. God has made you a son and daughter of God. Oh Shaba. God is inviting you into His space. Ah Shaba. Osiah. Those who call. Jesus, uh, their Lord, what will recognize, recognize what his voice, under the Diosai, and he will always what protect them, under the Diosai. This doesn't mean their life will be without calamity, but it does mean they will have what a shepherd who is always.